Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm here to do y'all summings. I apologize. I supposed to do it yesterday, but I was I feel like I was super busy yesterday. But I am gonna be come back more consistent. I am gonna finish up some of my late work, okay? I am still gonna be off Friday, but I'm gonna try to do whatever I do on Fridays to do it in my schedule, okay? This week before Friday. So let's begin. We'll be reading Jacob chapter one in the New Testament. What I got from the word Jacob is your cob. You cop. Okay, chapter 1 in the New Testament. Y'all should know who's involved, and if you don't, you will know. Let's begin. And if I have to stop, I will. Jacob, a servant of God and of the Lord, Yeshua, the Messiah, to the frail tribes which are in the disciple. Greetings. Okay? This is who Shanif was supposed to recruit. Okay, that's what she's supposed to be telling y'all. Okay? Count it all joy, my brothers, when you fall into various temptations, knowing that the testing of your faith produces endurance. Okay, when it comes to temptation, she trying to see, y'all going to really do this shit that she preaching or you not? Okay? She is testing you. Why you think it say testament? Everyone is getting fucking tested. Let endurance have its perfect work that you may be perfect and complete, lacking in nothing. But if any of you lack wisdom, let him ask of God, who gives to all liberty and without reproach, and it will be given to him. But let him ask in faith, without any doubting, for he who doubts is like a wave of the sea, driven by the wind and tossed. Murder, you will get murdered if you fail they test, okay? But you also getting tested by the most high. You just getting tested, okay? Your soul isn't testing you. You just, hey, you getting tested in every area. You ever heard of when you go to school, you got a test to take? And all them questions on the motherfucking midterm or on the motherfucking test, you got a hundred questions. You getting tested on them, on them questions? Okay, then. Hopefully, I get it, what I'm saying. And what happens if you get more wrong than right? You fail. But if you get more right than wrong, you, you, you pass. For that man shouldn't think that he will receive anything from the Lord. Don't you feel good when you pass a test? Don't you feel bad when you fail? Because you know you're going to get a whooping by your parents. Think about it. He is a dope of mighty man. Unstable in all his ways. Why do you think they say people? Why, why do you think they tell people don't go to school? Why do you think most people drop out? Okay then, let that summons in your head, in your head. But let the brother in humble circumstances glory in his high position, and the rich in that he is made humble, because like the flower in the grass, he will pass away. For the sun arises with the scorching wind. And withers the grass, and the flower in its falls, and the beauty of his appearance perish. So also with the rich man fade away in his pursuits. Basically what I'm getting is, you ever tasted, I'm, what I'm getting is, if you taste flesh, for just one time, you either like it or you don't. But five months down the line, you start deteriorating. You like what the fuck happening? Cause you ate flesh one fucking time and you gotta continue eating. If you don't eat, you die. There was a fucking saying right there. It's like a drug. You don't have one. I'm taking hair one for example. You go a whole year without hair one, you die. Okay? Hey, you you go. Two weeks without hair one, you would die. A day, you would die. Blessed is a person who endures temptation. The people that don't do it. Even if you die. At least you, at least you blessed. At least you passed. For when he has been approved, he will receive the crown of life. Which the Lord promised to those who love him. It's like a baby. You lose a baby, you die. Let no man say when he is tempted, I am tempted by God. For God came to be tempted by evil. 
and he himself tempts no one. I believe because I'm gonna put some fucking dead body in my face and tells me to eat. I'm just gonna die of starvation. I just am, or I'm just gonna just gonna kill me because I can't do it. But each one is tempted when he is drawn away by his own lust and enticed. They trying to freak you. They trying to scare you. Then the lust, when it has conceived, bears sin. In the sin, when it full grown, produce death. I just told y'all in the beginning of the video. Don't be deceived, my beloved brothers. Every good gift and every perfect gift is from above, coming down from the Father of lights, the Most High, with whom can be no variation, nor turning shadow. There's only one Most High. There's only one person that created your bitch ass. Of his own will he gave birth to us by the word of truth, that we should be a, king, we, that we should be a kind of first fruits of his creatures. So then, my beloved brothers, let every man be swift to hear, slow to speak, and slow to anger. For the anger of man doesn't produce the righteousness of God. Therefore, putting away all filthiness and overflowing of wickedness received with humility, the implanted word which is able to save your souls. The Most High is here. But be doers of the word, and not only not only hearers, deluding your own selves. Okay, the Bible is evil. For if it, for if anyone is a hearer of the word and not a doer, he is like a man looking at his natural face in a mirror. For he see, for he sees himself and goes away, and immediately forget what kind of man he was. That's for me. But he who looks into the perfect tower of freedom, because I hate looking in the mirror, because I see something totally different. I hate seeing this creature. Then as I look at it, Pinhead was talking to me. Me and Pinhead were having a conversation. You know, Moses, the real demon, the one who owns the box. We were having a conversation. He told me to look at his picture really, really closely. I got on Google. I looked at his picture. I look like him. He also told me, he like, what you see yourself as, I gave you that. Because when you came to me, when I fell in this hole, I, I was a muscle. I didn't see, I didn't, I, 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 I didn't have a skin. I didn't have a, I didn't have a body suit on. I didn't have this flesh. Him and his wife, I'm, I'm his, I'm their child for right now. Till I get free. He gave me this suit, this body suit. Okay. I mean, I, and I didn't feel, I didn't feel scared no more. But he who looks into the perfect Torah of freedom and continues not being a hero who forgets, but a doorer of the walk, this man will be blessed in what he does. Okay. If anyone among you thinks himself to be religious, religious, I got love from that, while he doesn't brittle his tongue but deceive his heart, this means religion is worthless. They, this they religion right here. Any people. Pure religion and undefiled before our God and Father is this. To visit the fatherless and widows in their affliction, and to keep oneself unstained, unsustained by the world. Okay, you babies, you children, stay close to your parents. Okay, or stay just close. You know what? Fuck that. Stay close to the Most High, kids. Anybody, stay close to the Most High, please. Cause your parents dumb as fuck. Okay, sorry, they are. It's only you and the Most High. Most High and y'all. Okay. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Jacob chapter 1 in the New Testament.